Hello guys, I'm here with another commentary. So this commentary is about some machines I've made. And this machine, it's just like a simple vending machine. Get that cart of the way. Okay, so we have the cart return. We have some bread. We have apples, cookies, and some fish. Now, let's just say I wanted some bread. So I push the button with a bread, and out comes a cart, which is full of bread. So then I press the cart return, and the cart just goes back in. And the same goes with the apples, I just press the button. A cart comes out with apples. And then I press the cart return, and it returns the cart. Just exactly the same with cookies, press the button. Out comes the cart, full of cookies, and I can press the cart return, and it returns the cart. And fish. Press the button, cart comes out with fish. Now let's say someone think that, thinks that they're really funny, and places a minecart on there and press the cart return and thinks they've broke the machine. Now now they may be wondering like did I break the machine? Did it work? Um what? Wait, is that my cart? Then they may press it yeah, well yeah. Well this is basically what happens. That's inside the vending machine and those carts go onto those detector rails which flips the memory latch or whatever it's called I can't remember and that way it if someone has sends a cart it will just go that way and up and come back as you see there so that's my vending machine now on to the other machine which is right over there now this is actually like an automatic bridge maker. It automatically makes a bridge without me having to do anything. So let me just, yeah. So now the redstone clock is activated and it will start making the bridge. And yeah, there you can see that's the generator. It generates cobblestone and then the piston pushes it and over there we have another piston which pushes that cobblestone to those two pistons that actually make the bridge and almost done with the first part of the bridge there pistons can't push further than that so now the bridge will just start making another one because we have two pistons you could make three pistons and it will be a three block wide bridge. As most of you know, pistons can't push obsidian. That's why there's obsidian blocks there. So when the bridge is complete, it won't just make a whole bunch of cobblestone. So, yeah. Now the bridge is almost complete. And I mean, there's not much more to it. It just makes the bridge. Except one thing that it automatically it automatically repairs itself which you will see in a second now we can see that the bridge stops because it it's trapped it can't do anything because it can't push obsidian and it can't go further than that now here it is where I break the machine or where I break the bridge and as you can see it just starts repairing itself So now the bridge has repaired itself and it's just going back to the original state where it's ready to work again. I mean, there's not much more 
to the machine. But I mean, this would be great if you were maybe in Skylands or something like that. We have to get across all of the lands in the sky. So yeah, that was basically it. I will see you next time. Bye.